Hello everyone, welcome back to another video with Creative Commerce. So today we will be learning an ITCSC accounting topic which is manufacturing accounts and we will uh, see the basics of a manufacturing account. So a manufacturing account is always made by a manufacturing business and it includes direct and indirect costs of a factory. It shows the total cost of production and the formula for um, the formula for prime cost or direct cost so prime cost and direct cost mean the same so the formula is direct material plus direct labor plus direct expenses which is equal to prime cost or direct cost and the formula for total cost is the prime cost plus the administration cost plus the selling and distribution cost plus the financial charges. So that is equal to the total cost. So there are three types of inventory. First is raw materials. So raw materials is basically the total cost of the component parts currently in stock. And these uh, component parts have not been used uh, in work process, neither in finished goods production. So these are which is currently there, the current stock. Then it is indirect labor. So here is cleaners wages, crane drivers wages, indirect labor and factory supervisors wages. And in, under indirect expenses is rent of a factory, depreciation of factory and machinery, depreciation on loose tools. And second type of inventory is work in progress. So work in progress is a semi-finished goods which are waiting for completion. So they have not yet like completed making those goods, but they are like almost uh, finished. Third type of inventory is finished goods. So finished goods are like the number of manufactured products which are in stock and they are available for customers to purchase. So finished goods are basically the goods which are already um, done, they are already manufactured and those goods are available for the customers to purchase. So now we'll have a look at what comes under prime cost and direct cost. So now direct costs are basically the costs which are directly in link uh, to the production uh, cost. So first is the direct labor, direct materials and the direct expenses. Now under overhead cost or indirect cost. So these are the costs which are not like directly linked with the production process. So these are the indirect materials, indirect labor, and indirect expenses. Now under direct material comes opening raw material, purchase of raw materials, carriage inwards, and closing raw material. Then is direct labor. So under direct labor, there is direct wages. Indirect wages, it's like bakers, carpenters, or the machine operators. Then is factory wages and factory operator wages. Then is direct expenses. Under direct expenses, first it is royalty. So this is basically the fee paid to the inventor of the product. Then is the higher charge for a piece of equipment. Now under indirect materials comes lubricants, tools, oils, and handcrafts. The cost of operating forklift trucks, factory power, factory lighting, general factory expenses so it's really important for you to learn what comes under each like what comes under direct expenses what comes under indirect expenses selling and distribution costs so under this comes commission on sales carriage outwards and discount allowed so these three are the things which are not supposed to be taken in a manufacturing account and under administration expenses comes the administration salaries and under financial charges the bank charges and these two as well are not taken in a manufacturing account and this is the end of our video i hope you found this video informative and if you did find this useful please like my video and subscribe to my channel as well as keep the bell icon on so that you get updated with more of my upcoming videos and remember we'll be making videos on itcs accounting business and economics thank you for watching crazy commerce